this move or whatever and the dude like broke his toe popped his toe did something to his toe so he was like I'm not going back to jujitsu I just keep getting hurt so he started hot yoga <laughs> getting ready for my first hot yoga session it is in um champagne well urbana illinois and so i'm really excited i haven't done that before and yeah i'm gonna just get ready for it and i'll i'm gonna do a french braid so i'll show you guys my french braid routine okay so yes i am going to do a french braid french braid my hair i'll kind of show you my outfit i'm just wearing a white under armor tank high-waisted camo leggings so yes i'm very excited <laughs> hard to tell what I'm doing since I can't see it really but um whatever my hair is short you know so it's the best that I can do okay I'm gonna fill up my water bottle and <clears throat> we're gonna go to yoga guys yay also real quick before I leave I wanted to show you guys um my bomba socks that came in the mail today we recently um discovered Bambas. These two are both no-shows. And then this is like a calf, a calf sack to wear my with my high top counters. And then I also have another pair too. But anyways, they're really cool. If you guys don't know what Bambas are, you should definitely check them out. Um, one pair purchased equals one pair donated to someone in need. And they've donated over, I think, 20 million actually already. So that's really cool. But anyways, they're very freaking comfortable. They're a little bit pricey but I think they're worth the price they're very comfortable you can't really go wrong with these socks they're awesome I haven't tried the no show yet but I'm excited to try them with my tennis shoes because I don't wear anything but no shows with tennis shoes um so yeah they're really cool and let's see what does the back say it says at Bombas we're big fans of bees sure they're little but they have some big ideas like the whole hive working together to make things be better. We like that. In fact, we like to think of the world as one big hive. By purchasing this little pair of socks, you've helped to pollinate the world as one pair of socks will be donated to a person in need. See? That's so cool. You guys should totally help out and buy a pair of Bombas. You will not be disappointed, I'm telling you. Okay, little review for the vlog. Okay, I am leaving my house. I'm going to stop and get gas and a big water for my drive to Champagne since it's like 40 minutes, 35, 40 minutes. And then I'm actually leaving a little bit early so I can stop in Target. I want to get a new um, like tripod for my phone since I lost one and maybe a car mount, mount as well. And I'm gonna get a juice, I think, maybe before we go. Before I go, I'm kind of nervous, so I don't want to like sweat so much and then throw it up, you know. But yes, so 
We are going to the gas station if I can ever get across. It's never ending traffic on this road, especially at this time. It's 5.15 right now. Yeah, I don't think I'm gonna get across for a while. Let's see, it's 5.15, we'll see how long it takes. Here comes all this traffic from this way. Seriously, buy everything in here right now. Like, look at these lights, they're so cute. I want this chair for my non existing patio. Everything is so cute. Okay, I made it to my destination, the yoga place. Um, I only got one thing at Target. I didn't get anything else, believe it or not. I wanted to go into Home Goods, but I was running short on time. It is 7 o'clock. It starts at 7.30, and I'm supposed to be here like 15 minutes early. So I'm going to go in here in a few minutes. And I think I have to sign something. But I'm eating a Cliff Bar before I go in. People are walking by and watching me film. <laughs> it's so awkward. There's actually a guy sitting right across from me. And like, um an old jeep smoking a cigarette just staring at me but i don't care anyways i'm gonna drink a little bit more water and then head in there Okay, I just got done. It started at 7.30. It is now 8.44. I didn't think it was possible for me to sweat like I did. I didn't even know I could sweat that much. I burned 238 calories in one hour just doing hot yoga. But it was awesome. I definitely am going to come back. I probably will just get like a membership yoga thing here and come as often as I can. The only thing that sucks is that it is in Champagne, so I do have to work my work schedule around it, but it was awesome. I highly re recommend it to anyone. It's cool too, because one of the first people that I met, um, he was asking me how, why I decided to do hot yoga, and I was just telling him how I just started jujitsu, and I've just been wanting to try new things, and like just practicing self self-care and stuff like that and he was like that's so funny that you say you've been doing jujitsu because I did jujitsu and the second class I went to I um rolled around with a wrestler and he was strong and really good at wrestling so he was already good at jujitsu and all of a sudden he like put him in this move or whatever and the dude like broke his toe popped his toe did something to his toe so he was like, I'm not going back to jujitsu. I just keep getting hurt. So he started hot yoga <laughs> instead, which is so funny because I got into jujitsu because of a wrestler named Bryce. So coincidence. He was cool though. Everyone was really nice. It was awesome. Um, definitely do it if you have it near you. It's so much fun actually and really relaxing. I mean, it is hot. You do sweat the entire time, but it's a good sweat at least you know you're doing something with yourself you know so I'm gonna drive home now Bryce probably just got done actually at his jujitsu class him and his good buddy went to um, Mattoon tonight to um, go to a different jujitsu practice because they have a tournament this weekend so they've been trying to practice a little bit more than usual he won't be home till like 10 though at night so I'm gonna go home probably eat like a salad or something real quick because I'm really hungry and take we'll take a shower first and then go to bed but 
I will see you guys very soon or tomorrow. What's today? Today's Thursday the 2nd. I have a massage Monday and then I have jujitsu Monday and then I think I'm gonna come back on Thursday, next Thursday, to another yoga session, so. And I've been working out. Remember like two, three vlogs ago, Bryce was like, her motivation sucks, she never works out. I'm like a whole new person, you guys. I've been working out four to five days a week for the last two weeks, been eating healthy. We eat healthy anyways, though, like regardless if we're working out or not, we eat pretty healthy, but yeah, I'm on a roll, motherfuckers. I'm on a roll. So anyways, I will see you guys sometime soon. Who knows when? All right, bye. Happy Monday morning. Oh, it's kind of cold. Good morning, everyone. It is a Monday. The, um, what day is it? Alexa, what day is it? It's Monday, May 6th. May 6th? Happy Monday, May 6th. Um, today is massage day. I'm so excited. I have only ever had one massage in my whole entire life, and it was a 30-minute massage, and today is a 60-minute massage. I'm so excited. Um, it is 9.44. I am going to go tan real quick and go and get a few groceries from the store. And my massage is at noon, so then I'm going to go get a massage, and then after that, I'll probably come home and do some stuff around the house and then go work out. I don't know if you should go work out after a nice relaxing massage, but that's what I'm going to do. So, this vlog is going to be kind of more about, like, just self-care and what I've been doing to kind of just keep my mind positive. Um... But I have been, I did that hot yoga class last Thursday. I've been doing, I did jujitsu last Monday. And um, this week I'm going to go to yoga again. I loved the yoga class. I loved it so much. It was so cool. And I loved how much I like sweat during it. Um, and I'm going to work out five days a week this week. I, starting this, um, the year challenge so today starts my first day of it and we're gonna grill steaks tonight and yeah so I will take you guys with me to tan to go to my massage and to go work out later okie dokie I'll see you guys soon okay so first I actually forgot I have a return for TJ Maxx so I'm gonna stop there then on my way back, go to the county market, go tan, and then go to the bank so I can get money out to pay for my massage. Okay, um, let's see if I can get across this vermilion. Actually, I, I'm sure they take card, right? Like, I don't need to pay with cash. But I should probably just get some cash out because I never have cash. And Bryce is always like, you should carry cash. <laughs> I might be able to get across. It's so nice out. It's already 64 degrees and it's only 10 o'clock. It's supposed to get to 70 and sunny today. And then, of course, tomorrow and Wednesday it's supposed to rain. But then I think it's supposed to go back to being sunny. So, let's hope so. Okay, I just got to County Market. I'm going to run in and get those few little items that I need. I just left TJ Maxx. I did my return. And then after this, I'm going to go tan real quick go home or rinse off my body so I don't smell like tanning and then um, probably eat a quick lunch and then go to my massage yay
two different guys have been the only ones in there. I'm not saying it's wrong or weird. I've just never knew they were interested in working at tanning salons. Okay, I am like overly hot though right now. It's 72 degrees um, and I kind of have a headache. So I'm going to go home, drink some water, make some sun tea. I haven't made sun tea since we lived at the apartment. That's been like two years ago. So I'm going to do that since it's nice and sunny today. And then I'm going to rinse my body off and go to my massage. Okay, I just got home. I got this little cheap thing from County Market. It was like a dollar, but whatever. I'm just making tea in it. This is the black tea I got. And I got some Mother's Day cards that I need to fill out. I'm going to fill this up with water. Fuck that, that's going to take forever. So it has to be hot water, so I'm just going to get the sink water real hot. And then I usually put three or four tea bags in it and let them, um, let the jug sit out in the sun for like four hours, three to four hours. Okay, she is full. So then I just toss these babies in there and wait for it to turn a kind of color. I don't know, should I do four? I think three is good. And then I will let it go out in the sunshine. All right, let's see. Where am I going to put it? I'm kind of nervous to put it out in the back because we have squirrels who just go after everything. But I feel like this would be my best bet. They probably won't mess with this, right? Look at our grass, it's finally growing. <laughs> Bryce put straw down. You can finally see it peeking up. Okay, well, I will come back for this in about four hours. Okay, it is 11.50. I am on my way over there. It's only like a four minute drive from my house, so I don't actually, have, I don't even have any idea where it is, but I looked it up on the maps and it said it was four minutes away, so we shall see when I get there. Okay, we made it. <laughs> it's really cute. I've never been here before. really cute. It's like a huge freaking house. marks on my face and my hair okay so I've come to a conclusion that I am not fit for massages the very first one I had I didn't love and I wanted to try it again just to see and you know what I would rather have a facial I am so ticklish first of all that half the time everything tickles me so I'm trying my hardest not to tense up and like pull away my foot or my hand or something and then it kind of just hurts me <laughs> I don't know why but yeah I would rather just get a facial and I probably won't ever get a massage again but I kind of have always wanted to try like the stone massages but I don't know if those would hurt I don't know I mean it was relaxing for sure but I did not like when she did my face and like my ears and like now I'm greasier than fuck so I'm gonna go home and take a shower and then go work out <laughs> okay 
that's the update on the massage. The place was really nice, though. I mean, it was nice. She was nice. Everyone was nice. I'm just not... I don't like being touched, so I don't know what the fuck I was thinking. Anyways, <laughs> I'd rather get, like, a free two-minute half-assed massage from Bryce. <laughs> All right, I will go home, and then I'll see you guys at the gym. Okay, I'm going to eat a salad real quick with blue cheese and drink some water, and then I'm going to go work out. I really just had to force myself to get up off the couch and get ready to go to the gym. I was falling asleep on the couch, but I know if I don't go now, then I will not go at all today. So, got my bag. I always wear slides to the gym. Um, I always change into my tennis shoes there. Where's my wallet? Oh, is it in the car already? I need to fill up my water bottle too really fast. Oh, I should bring my tea in too. It's looking good. It's gonna be so yummy. I love black tea. I don't know if anyone else does, but it's really good. Okay, I'm gonna fill up my water bottle really quick and then I will see you guys at the gym. Okay, day one, week one. Chest and calves. chest and calves today and my chest is the weakest part of my body I cannot handle much weight at all and since I didn't have a spotter I really couldn't do much but I still completed the workout even though it was hard and I need to definitely work on my chest um, I'm gonna stop at Madigo and get a protein smoothie and then go and get butter for our sweet corn that we're making tonight and bandages for Bryce because he had a jiu-jitsu um, jiu competition this weekend in Springfield and his feet are like tore, tore to pieces. They are terrible, but I'm gonna get him like a band-aid <laughs> so he can wear shoes and socks and it, his feet not be rubbed raw because they are disgusting. Okay, you guys, I just got done with my back and leg workout. Oh, it was hot, it was sweaty. It is 59 degrees. I think it's supposed to be like 80 degrees today. Um, I have to work at one today. And st I was actually supposed to be off today, but I'm working one to nine. It is Wednesday the 8th, so you will be seeing this vlog tomorrow. This vlog is kind of all over the place with my yoga, with my workouts, with just random things. Um, I kind of just wanted to film like a what I've been doing health and fitness wise. Um, I'm trying to stay on top of my health and fitness. And so far I've been doing really well. The last three weeks I've been going steady at the gym. And like I've said, we eat pretty healthy anyway, so I don't really have to worry about that. But yeah, so I hope you guys enjoyed this vlog. If you did, please give it a thumbs up. And if you haven't already, please subscribe and I will see you guys very soon. Thank you for watching. Oh, 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 oh,